Today's newest listing is perfect timing for the upcoming holiday season. This kitchen is to die for with lots of cabinet and counter space, including not only a peninsula, but an island as well. Lots of great space for you to really gather and enjoy and make some new memories. Stay tuned. It's Amy with Heart and Home Orlando and welcome to one of our newest listings, 240 Whirlaway Drive. We are out here just outside of the Champions Gate area, which is a hugely popular area, super close to Disney. This home is going to provide you some great opportunities, really no matter what you're looking for. So this home, by the way, beautiful sunshiny day here in Florida. And yes, I understand that it is today actually is Halloween as we're filming this video. Beautiful, beautiful sunshiny day. And you know what? All of those beautiful rays beaten down on the included solar panels here with this home really is going to make this even more energy efficient. Okay, so this is a beautiful two-story floor plan, a little over 2,600 square feet. I think it's 2,617 square feet, four bedrooms, three full baths, and one of those bedrooms is located here on the first floor. In fact, we're going to take a tour and let's go take a peek at that one right now. So right over here, as soon as you enter into the front door over here to the right, to my left, to your right, is the downstairs bedroom. So this is technically a bedroom. You've got a full bath directly beside it. You have a full closet. Thinking about you and your family, how would you want to utilize this space? You could utilize it as an office. You could use it as a sitting room or a guest room area, but it's a beautiful spot located right here at the front of the home. Lots of beautiful sunshine coming in through the window. And then again, a full bath located directly outside with the shower stall in there. So no, not tub shower combo, but you've got a big oversized shower in there. All right, so here we are into the main hub of the home. And one of the main reasons that this floor plan is so accommodating is look at all of this space. So let's take a peek over here first. Nice big family room or gathering room. And you know, that's funny because you look at the uh, <clears throat> new construction builder floor plans and they refer to this space as the gathering room. And you know what? That's exactly what it's for. A lot of square footage right here for the friends and family. This is going to be your kind of main day-to-day -day area, your main gathering space, if you will. So lots of square footage here. Big oversized room. Beautiful flooring, by the way. So as we take a look at this resale home, by the way, built in 20 2017, so not very old. Again, four bedrooms, three baths, a little over 2,600 square feet. The finishes here in this home, you do have a beautiful, um, a nice tile floor, wood plank that's extended all through this first floor living area. Family room, gathering area, kitchen, and then of course the nook that we're going to see off to the side. The only things that are carpeted here are going to be the stairs, upstairs bedrooms, and then again the downstairs bedroom. So lots of beautiful options here, including the taller baseboards. So you already have an upgraded taller baseboard here, freshly painted by the way, newly painted right before the listing went active. And then here is the kitchen and this is one of my favorite things. I love this. So first of all, you have an island, but you also have a peninsula and then you have a huge area over there for dining. This is amazing. So what a nice layout, a really smart kitchen layout, especially if you are a person who, if you like to cook, you like to entertain, this is a great option for that. Lots of counter space right here at the island. You've got the two pendants. You've certainly got room here for seating if you want. Nice big pantry to the side. All appliances convey, by the way, including the washer and dryer that we're going to take a look at upstairs. You have a darker cabinet, a beautiful granite countertop here as well. You have the range, <clears throat> excuse me, the oven with the microwave up above. And then over here, this is like the extra bonus spot. So over here, you have another peninsula. So just imagine with me, we're approaching holiday season, but just imagine the spot where you're either carving the pumpkins for Halloween, maybe you're doing some things for Thanksgiving, maybe you are baking cookies for the holiday season. What a great surface right here for all of that fun with the family all gathered around and decorating those cookies as well. This is a fantastic spot, and it's definitely something that's unique to this specific floor plan in this particular home. Love, love, love love this extra opportunity. Speaking of extra opportunity, how about this extra space over here? So this is a structural option that was added to this home from the builder, which is really great because now you have not only island, 
and by the way this is an overhang here too so when you talk about bar or counter seating you've got room here for three or four easily and another two to three over there all right here at your island at your peninsula but then over here you can have your actual dining table whether it's a circle whether it's an oval whether it's an, a rectangle and whether you add that leaf into it really extend it this is a huge room over here by the way this room has the sliders it's going to take you out to a covered lanai space so while we're here let's do a quick little talk about the outdoor space so your covered lanai space is already screened in. So you have a ceiling fan out there, two lights. You have already screened in with a door that's gonna to access to your already fenced in backyard. So you have a really nice sized backyard. You can absolutely build a pool or create your own outdoor oasis if you like. Nice, beautiful, mature tree over there as well. This is a really, really, really great spot. Really kind of combining a lot of indoor entertaining opportunity as well as a great outdoor space to continue that. All right, so let's go take a peek upstairs. So just as a reminder, again, we came in through the front door. We had a bedroom with a full bath over here and then all of this fun, big, open um, hub of the home, we like to call it. So upstairs, you're going to have three more bedrooms, a loft and another full bath, and of course, the primary bedroom's bathroom. So as soon as you come up, here we are in the loft space. So you have the same carpet throughout. Carpet, everything has been freshly cleaned here in the home. You've also had, um, again, everything was freshly painted right before the listing went active as well. So right here, you're going to have your loft space. Great spot for that extra zone, whether it's young kids and they need a playroom, whether it's medium age kids or those adult kids that want to play their video games or watch their own Netflix series or their movies, this is a great extra little bonus space right here. Right across the hall from that, you're going to have that primary bedroom or that owner suite and it is huge. Look at this big room, certainly going to accommodate any massive amount of uh, California king size bed that you might want here. Big, big, big space, lots of wall space, by the way. So lots of different ways that you could actually orient or situate your furniture, which I always think is really nice. Um, sometimes when you walk into a house and you see that, okay, well, there's only one place for that headboard to go, but not here in this particular primary suite. You've got a lot of opportunities. You can really situate those, that bedding furniture, however you want. Directly off of that, of course, you're gonna have your primary bathroom. You're gonna have the privacy door here for the toilet. You've got a linen closet over here. You've got your two sinks with your quartz countertop. You've got your cabinets, your drawers. You have a really beautiful updated shower as well with a bench on it. So let's think about this. Think about you and your family. Sometimes we need that little extra help. Maybe that bench is going to be super helpful. And then here's that primary bedroom's closet. This is a huge oversized closet. So imagine, first of all, there's plenty of space with the racks and the storage system that is already in place. But take a minute and dream with me, and if you had a custom closet designer in here, this is an absolute amazing opportunity. Lots and lots and lots of storage and opportunity space here in this closet. So primary bedroom is an absolute A+. plus. Lots of things can be checked off your list with this one. And if we're looking for some more additional bedrooms, we still have two more bedrooms to see, another full bath, and of course the laundry room. So here's the first of the secondary bedrooms with the bedroom on the first floor. We just saw the primary bedroom. Here's gonna be bedroom number three. So nice bedroom over here, again, located toward the front of the home. Silly little thing, but I love that it has a little angled wall. It just gives me a little bit more of a personality vibe here with these rooms, sometimes instead of just a big square. You can see you're gonna have the accordion doors for a nice big closet as well. So right outside of this bedroom will be the next bedroom. Now this one, in my opinion, is a little bit bigger than the other ones. You can tell by the dimensions of the rooms. This one is slightly larger, but also located here at the front of the home. So it is a nice, bright bedroom with, again, lots of wall space for you to kind of situate and orient your furniture. Love, love, love this. Directly outside of this is going to be the full bath that these extra, bath, uh, ba uh, extra bedrooms are going to be sharing. So another nice, big bathroom. You've got the two sinks. Again, you have a nice tub shower combo for this one. Lots of space in here. And then over here is going to be your laundry room. Laundry room has the appliances that are going to convey. So your washer dryer convey. You've got some shelving. You have attic access. And then the door back behind me, you're going to have access to your AC handler. All right. So this is a lot packed into this home. 2,617 square feet, four bedrooms, three full baths, 
plus the loft space upstairs, plus that crazy awesome kitchen that is very unique. And that's what I love about it. I love seeing homes that have their own little piece of personality. And that kitchen kind of got me from the first day I came in. My mind started kind of just wandering with all of the wonderful things you could do in that kitchen. Not only the counter seating, but then the extra space um, beside it. But let's not forget the huge backyard as well. So this is an absolute great opportunity, a great find. Again, we are out here in Davenport, Florida. So we are just minutes from Disney. So if you want to live here full time, great option for you. This is not zoned short-term rental. So this is not going to be a place where you can use it as an investment property and have someone come in here and renting it on a week to week or day to day or weekend to weekend basis. This is purely a residential community. So you can have your permanent residence here, or if you want to make this your primary or your uh, private vacation home, another great option as well, because you can really maximize the benefits of the proximity to all of the things that are wonderful, the parks, the recreation. And of course, Champions Gate itself has everything you could possibly want or need to do to fill in those gaps if you're kind of swapping between parks. All right, guys, thank you so much for joining me. This is a wonderful opportunity. If you are interested, please give me a call at 407-848-8042. We would love to make this beautiful house your new home. Have a great day. Please stay safe, stay well. Remember, we love you. Happy house hunting.